guys what is up welcome back to the channel today we're jumping here doing something a little di different and i got something to show you guys i've been working on this for quite some time it's one of the reasons why i've been away from streaming recording or any of that stuff we have decided to make a hosting company and try to help a lot of you guys out in trying to host your own server whether it's 5pd whether it's minecraft whether it's uh, a whole server that you want for 5M, or whether it's uh, Red Dead Redemption or American Truck Simulator, we can provide that for you. Um, the new company is called VStream Hosting, and here's the website. VStream Hosting provides a lot of hosting for the game server that you are looking for. We started back uh, last year and had trouble getting customers, and now we got a few of them. So we have three active clients right now. Also, I use my own stuff to host my stuff on there to use a test server for you guys. So right now we have FX server, we have Russ, Gary's Mod, we have Arc, American Truck Simulator, DayZ's, Armor 3, TeamSpeak, and Minecraft. So we have all these and we are ready for you guys to just join up, start your server up, and just be able to uh, do whatever you want to do in your own server. Now, I know a lot of you guys are probably like, oh, man, this guy's pulling our leg, man. There is no way he came over to a hosting company and he's able to give us even the slightest no lag server. I'm not going to lie to you. We probably will give you lag at times, but I'm going to tell you this now. You will get your money's worth. I mean, even if you get lag, if you try to request a refund within our refund policy days, you will get credit for you to be able to buy you a new server for free. So the beginner's plan, it comes with three gigabytes of DDR4 RAM and 15 gigabyte SSD. So, and if we move down to the bottom, it gets a little bit more expensive. You got the Empire plan, which is 32 gigabyte of DDR4 RAM and it's 180 gigabytes SSD. We did have promotional deals going on, but sadly those promotional deals have stopped. And then we want to get you guys to get some more promotional deals on, like the summer promotional deals coming. And then after the summer one, we're going to do a different one afterwards. So this is the way that our panel looks like when you buy one of the servers. I will do a tutorial video on this so you guys can see how to set up the server exactly. Um, I've had this server set up for quite some time, a few months. You can also put your files in here this way by here. And I'll show you the database the way that it is now. You just go to TX Data, then you go to EXX Legacy Default, and you go to Resources, and this is where all your stuff is at. So see, as you can see, these are where my scripts are at and all that kind of stuff. So if you go back out of here, we can go back to Database. This will be where your, your database will be at. And if you go to Schedules, you know, that's where your schedules will be at. Users, these will be your users that are on there. Backups, you can create a backup here. This is where our network is at. You can change which one you want primary. I'm not gonna change it right now because it's already been set. And this is where all your startup come. Make sure you change this license key right here so that way you get a, a new license key. Uh, you can change your server name to whatever name you want. Obviously don't mess with this, keep that the same. Do not mess with that. And then the 5 version, keep that the same and then 48 max player. So keep all that stuff the same. Um, all this stuff, you don't need to worry about any of this. And you can also download the SFTP, Win SFTP, to be able to put things to your server more quickly. And that's pretty much it, how you navigate this. And obviously, we do have TX Admin here. So that way, you can have the full reign of everything, TX Admin and the panel. Now, we also have a Discord here already set up for people to go. It's already monetized with, a, with the bots where... If you do a lot of spamming, the bot will time you out. Um, we already have a YouTube notification stuff. We already have an application bot. We already have a dino bot that monitors every messages that's been sent. So say for instance, someone decides to harass you and you want proof of the harassment and all that stuff, we have it, all the proof. So our applications now are right now are closed so if you join the discord and try to apply you won't be able to see the application room um we have a normal boosting room so that way you could boost the uh, server and it's a normal room so um we have a regular chat giveaways that will be starting it's all there guys it's all there 
And I'm not gonna pull your tongue anymore. I'm gonna go ahead and log on to my server and I'm gonna show you guys where this is. As you can see, we're already about to log on to New Life Roleplay. And we're about to go ahead and change builds. That's one thing I've always forget. I always have that whitelisted thing on and I'm trying to work. I'm trying to get it to work basically. Uh, it's not working for me, even though I put the right discord role and it just doesn't work. But I mean, we'll get it eventually, I believe. But we're going to go ahead and try to jump into the server and you guys are going to see that it's fully working. We really just started this up and we've been patting ourselves on the back because we've been keeping it alive and well and it's been pretty good. Don't worry about how the city looks, that is my graphics. But uh yeah, no lag whatsoever. Get to jump around, see all the stuff. It's pretty amazing, guys. Get to take his car, get him out of here, fool. And get to chill. Pretty amazing, guys. But that's going to do it for all of us at Restream Hosting and all of us here, which is myself at King Test 2302. We we'll appreciate you guys always coming out and enjoying the videos. A quick reminder of the channel I will be getting back to full time streaming and doing videos. I did have to delete my LSPDFR, so I'm going to have to redo everything because it just kept crashing, didn't want to work, and I got really tired of it, so I had to delete it. But on that note, I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.